So last time we looked at how you can show these first derivative formulas. Uh, I thought, actually on second thought, perhaps I should work through them all. So here we go. If you want to do the derivative of the cinch of x, and this is the same thing as the derivative of e to the x minus e to the minus x all over 2. And this is the same thing as 1 half. The derivative of e to the x is just itself minus the derivative of e to the minus x is minus e to the minus x. And so this becomes 1 half e to the x plus e to the minus x, and that's exactly cosh of x as claimed. All right, and now when we come to the derivative of uh, the cosh of x, that's the same, let's put a little line there. That's the same thing as the derivative of e to the x plus e to the minus x all over 2. Pull the half out, so this is a half derivative of e to the x plus e to the minus x. And so I get a half, and then I get itself, e to the x. The derivative of e to the x is itself, and then I take the derivative here, and I get that thing times a minus 1 from the chain rule, which is, if you realize what this is, this is just e to the x minus e to the minus x over 2, which is exactly the cinch of x. So we got that one. And then I'll do uh, the derivative of tanch of x. This is the derivative of the cinch of x over the cosh of x. Quotient rule says take the derivative of the top. Derivative of cinch is cosh times the bottom is a cosh squared minus the top cinch times the derivative of the bottom, another cinch, so cinch squared x all over cosh squared, but then you realize cosh squared minus cinch squared is 1 over cosh squared, I, I forgot my x, cosh squared of x, and this is exactly cinch squared of x. So there's the first three. I think I said I would do them all. Uh, I'll just do those three. So in the next video should be the last one I do want to work through. Uh, what are these mysterious functions, right? I can define them. I can define cinch the way that we did, and it works. But why are they so like the trig functions and yet different? And what do they look like? So stay tuned. We'll answer that in the next video.